You've probably heard of quarks. In physics, they are the most elementary particles we know of, even smaller than atoms. But where does the name quark come from? Oddly, it links back to a Slavic food speciality. The term quark was first used around 1963 by Murray Gell-Mann. Gell-Mann was one of two physicists who came up with the quark model. He said he'd come across the word in one of his occasional perusals of Finnegan's Wake by James Joyce. Gell-Mann found it on page 383 in the phrase three quarks for master mark. The reference seemed perfect, as only three subatomic quarks were known at the time. Gell-Mann thought Joyce's phrase was a distortion of three quarts for Mr. Mark, a call for drinks you might hear in an English pub. But most Joyce scholars suspect it links to an altogether different call. According to them, Joyce picked up the word at some German marketplace from the phrase for Mr. Mark. In English, this means three Deutschmarks for excellent curd cheese. Quark, the German word for curd cheese, was originally taken from a Western Slavic language, most likely Lower Sorbian or Polish. That means the name of the smallest particle in the universe actually comes from the Slavic word for curd cheese. But perhaps this makes more sense than we think. The etymology of tvaruk goes back to the Proto-Slavic root tvoriti, which means to make, create or form. This seems like a perfect origin for the most basic element form in our reality. Especially since, like curd cheese, quarks also have different flavors. Just one of many words in English that have a surprising Polish history.